some people I know would have higher up is for me is natural ability, um, stroke, good hand-eye coordination. That is important, but I don't. I think practice and good technique can overcome. And without those two, you won't get anywhere in natural ability unless you play enough. Mm. So it's important, but I don't think it's it's uh, as high up as some people would have it. Like I've played against. Um, yeah, I've played against quite a few professionals. Not not always in tournaments, and sometimes in exhibition type matches. I've obviously played Martin O'Donnell up here and Alan Taylor a few times, they can't support the juniors. Um, I played uh, probably my favourite moment, even though I got hammered, was in an amateur tournament when I think I was about 18. And I played with Peter Ebden, and he was only young then, and he wasn't. Was he a professional? Oh, he, yes, he probably was. It was a pro, pro, pro am tournament. I think he was a young professional, and um, he completely bashed me up three 0 in about an hour. I think I hardly potted a ball. He was he was really good. Um, and although, as I say, although I lost, when he came, came on to become a top professional and world champion, I looked back on that moment and thought that was a that was you know a really good really good moment. The other one would probably be, again, looking back, the fact that I was um, 13 years old, I think, yeah, 1985 final, and I was a Steve Davis fan, and I was devastated. I stayed up till half past midnight to watch the black ball finish, but when I look back now, that was quite a historic, that was Snooker's biggest ever moment. becomes Embassy World Snooker Champion 1985. And I was, <coughs> I was watching it at the time, so yeah, probably my, my best moments. Uh, my highest break is 139. Um, I had my first 100 break when I was 16. Which I've been, which I've missed a lot of chances to get it through nerves, I think, and and then I've had a lot of hundred breaks, but I've never. I, I really want to have. I really wanted to have something over 140.